Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Alpha Monitor here. As many of you guys know, Mac OS X Line has been released. That is Mac OS X 10.7, but it does not come on a DVD, unfortunately. So if you have Snow Leopard, you can just upgrade immediately from the Mac App Store, paying $30 and getting the application. But if you have the one before that, then you have to actually buy Snow Leopard. Then you have to get Mac OS X Line. So it's just an extra upgrade and it costs more. But in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to put it on one of these babies so we can just insert it into any Mac you have and install Mac OS X Line right up as soon as your Mac is compatible with OS X Line. So what you're going to need today is a downloaded copy of OXS Lime. Now if you already have installed this, then it will not work. You have to do this before you have installed it on your Mac. So basically you can get this from the Mac App Store for $30 and I recommend that because you're going to get a stock version with no bugs or anything. Torrents always have bugs and it is illegal of course. You'll need that and you'll need this disk and let's just get started. So first what you're going to want to do is just go in your applications folder on the bottom right of your screen or wherever else you might have it. Then you want to find the install OS X line little application thing. Then you want to right click on that and it'll bring up the applications. Then you want to right click on this one and press show package contents. Then go inside of contents. Then you want to go inside shared support and see this install esd.dmg. Then you want to open up disk utility. Disk utility. Alright, so once you have that open, you want to drag this right here. I've already done it, so it's not going to come. So it says install esd.dmg. You want to just drag it right to your list that you should have right here. And then you want to highlight that. And then you just want to select burn. So I'm actually going to insert my DVD and press burn. And I'll be back once I've done so. Alright guys, so I'm about to burn it. I have it highlighted. I'm just going to select burn right up top. And it says ready to burn, but it is 3.74 gigabytes. So make sure you have a disk that is at least 3.74 gigabytes. You probably need more because usually it takes up more space. This one right here is about 4.7. So most DVD rewritable disks are about 4.7. So that will work fine. You just want to press a burn and you just want to wait till it's done. So this might actually take a while. I'm not sure how long. But I'll be back once it is done. All right, guys. So when it's done with the burning process, it'll say image install esd.dmg burn successfully. That did take about 20 minutes. It might take like 20 to 30 minutes depending on you guys' Mac computer. But now I'm just going to insert it back in and see if it pops up the install. All right, guys. So as you can see here, it says Mac OS X install esd right here. I'm going to double click. And let's see. Install Mac OS X line. And here you have it. Now you can install Mac OS X line straight from a bootable DVD. This is very great for you guys. Please go like my Facebook fan page. Of course, links down below. Follow me on Twitter. Add me to your circle on Google+. Please subscribe and ultimately, have a nice day.